my attack simulator project that I worked on with a couple colleagues of mine, uh, Dave Harold and Kyle Champlin that you see here on this slide, we basically put together a lot of different components because what we wanted to do was help defenders who were wanting to simulate attacks actually observe what those attacks looked like in their environment. Um, and, and obviously using Splunk, like we work for Splunk, but you don't have to use Splunk. This is uh, just the way we decided to do it and kind of build some additional content on top of this and do some integrations so that we could show um, defenders how to better detect stuff that they're observing in the wild, right? So to kind of step through this slide a little bit, um, we, have, we have Splunk, uh, we have Phantom, which is Splunk's SOAR platform. Um, both are available for free if you want to download Community Edition or the um, free trial version. Basically, we put an app together that uses the MITRE ATT&CK Navigator, the GitHub project um, to, that people are familiar with. And if you ever looked at MITRE ATT&CK, that's what I'm sure what you've seen. Um, we have a simulation runner that when we select a particular test from the ATT&CK Navigator, we kick it off. It goes over to Phantom, does a series of things, including uh, pulling tests from Atomic Red Team, um, and then, you know, specifically for, for um, some of what we're talking about today, I really want to highlight the, the Scythe integration where I built a phantom app that talks to Scythe's uh, API and allows us to go ahead and automatically kick off a Scythe campaign against the Windows host, for example, right? So we can do both the um, attack atomic red team stuff, and then we can also do more advanced things together with uh, Scythe. So, what that, hap what that does is then it, it uh, actually runs it on a Windows host, and then there's a uh, Splunk Universal Forwarder there that sends the events back to Splunk, right? So that was the quick high-level version. There's obviously a lot more to it. Um, if you want to see more about this project, I would say, you know, check out our presentation at Black Hat Arsenal. It's coming up um, just in a few weeks. This is the, uh, the information for 